Hey, this is Ace Bangler coming back to show you guys another tutorial video. This week it is a tank trap. This is a fairly basic design, but one that I found looks pretty pretty good, and it's not too hard to make. So here I just got a few samples for you. It's I guess the tank traps that actually were used in World War II. World War II weren't this rounded over, but it this uh, design uh, highlights the shape of the tank trap. It's got that that unique kind of double X uh, design. I know some people before have used like plates and crossed those, but I tried that. Didn't get quite as much of the equal equal. I don't know how it sits on this design it's equal on all sides so it's not lopsided if you set it down some way it's, it, whatever way you put it down it's always going to be uniform and equal so that's why I like this design so with that let's get right into it on how to make this it's pretty basic only four different parts required you're going to need one of these cross pieces one uh, rod, 12 one by one round bricks, and six of these studs. So with that let's just go ahead and start building. It won't take too long. It's fairly easy. With the one by one round bricks you're going to want to put two together and then put the stud on the end and then you're going to want six of these total. So we got our six here. And that's basically the the one part with those. And then you basically, once you have all this, you can assemble your your tank trap. So go ahead and start off by putting four of them around the X X or whatever these called wheels, steering wheel, whatever. And you put the rod in one of them, stick it through that and then basically it, there you're done. I usually try to, this part doesn't go in all the way but this part does. I try to pull this out a little bit just to make it a little bit more uniform, you see there. And that's your tank trap, so not too complex. As far as minifigure scale, it's about the same height as a minifigure which is Okay, in my opinion, I that's about how high. Well, the, uh, for real life, they probably were a little bit shorter, but I guess that's depending on the tank trap. There's b uh, many different uh, shapes and sizes that they came in. So uh, since minifigures are kind of small for a person scale, I feel like this is a decent size for a tank trap. So. That's basically a pretty simple design, not too hard to make, few rare pieces uh, needed to build it. So if you guys like what you saw, please like, comment, subscribe. Uh, we got weekly segments of building Itter Castle on my channel, so you definitely check those out. And we're trying to do tutorial videos every Wednesday or something out of the ordinary or maybe like a tank build vehicle build something like that but right now I've been on a tutorial trend so you could stay tuned for those on Wednesdays building Inter Castle on Sundays so thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you guys in the next video